Today, I want to share the story of my grandpa's rugs. Before I was born, my grandpa worked in Iran, and when he came back, he brought a lot of stuff with him, including these handmade rugs. Now, my mom always told us to be super careful around them because they were very expensive, handmade, and pretty much irreplaceable. Now, these rugs had very ornate designs, patterns that filled the entire rug. But to prove that they were handmade and expensive and not mass produced in a factory, the person who made them purposely put in a mistake. Now, the one particular rug that I remember had these blue dots all the way around the edge. And I looked forever in all the designs to find the mistake. And one of the blue dots was yellow. This was tangible proof that this was a handmade expensive rug because if it was made in a factory and they were making thousands of these rugs, that wouldn't have been possible. When I'm shooting somebody's headshot, everyone is so unique and different, whether they have a mole or a birthmark or one eye is a little bit smaller or their teeth are a certain way. Yes, we can go in and Photoshop. Yes, we can go make you look as good as possible, but that is not the point of a headshot or a portrait. The point is to capture who you are, uniquely made, individual, and perfect just the way you are. Now AI is coming around and I use AI all the time, pretty much every day in my job to make me more effective, better communicator, more productive, makes my Photoshopping easier. However, I wanna keep the authentic you in the photo and I never wanna remove that from the photo. And when I see people using a fully AI generated image as their photo. I get the draw, but the problem is, is it's too perfect. It's so perfect that it's actually imperfect. It doesn't work, it's not you. So just like those rugs have such value because they were handmade and each one was a little bit unique, so are you and I want you to embrace that. Don't run from that, embrace that. We use AI and AI is coming up more and more in the future. And like I said, I use it every day, but I don't take away your unique self. I keep you authentic and I think that's super important. Right now, it's actually pretty easy to tell when an image is AI, but it's getting better and better. But if it's too perfect, if it takes away who you are, that's missing the point. The point is to show the world who you are and embrace that. And I promise you having a quality photo that is uniquely you and only you, the value of that is just so important. Uh, whether it's to get new business leads, up your personal branding, or have something to show your future generations of kids or family or friends. So let's not lose that unique quality of who you are, because only you are you.